Hello, this is Mad Mike here, Yamaha GYTR Racing 21, and we are going to be fixing this Xbox right here. It's got the typical three red rings of death. Gotta love Microsoft for that. Anyways, we're going to be taking this apart. And I'll show you what I'm going to be doing to fix it. So, let's get started. Okay, so we got our side covers off. Now we need to pop these holes all on here. And all you got to do is pop it. And try to just keep it separated. See this one popped in here already. And pop this one. And just keep running down the line. Okay, we got that part separated. So just keep working down. Okay, so we got these popped, and all you gotta do is just open that up back here so it has slack. Then all you gotta do is come up here. Pop that. Pop this. And you gotta break this seal. As soon as you break that seal though, your warranty's voided. So know what you're doing when you're doing this. Pop this. Pop this. There you go. That's the top side of your Xbox there. Okay, so here we go. We got our Xbox right here. So we need to take these outer screws out. Also, these inner ones. So here we go.
There, there we go, fish out. Okay, now time to remake these extra clamps. We're gonna use this right here, it's just a little hook, and we're gonna go around the edge of them and pop them. Okay, got our axe clamps off. Now what we're gonna do is flip this around, hold your heat sinks so they don't fly off. This one's already off a little bit. And right there you go. Okay, so I got my setup all installed here. What it is is we're taking these off right here right here and these were on the heat sink they pretty much took the max clamps and what we did was we put spacers between these bolts to install it spacers between this heat sink now what we're going to do is we're going to actually turn it on and overheat it for 20 minutes to resolder back the joints now it sounds like a terrible idea, but that's the way we do it. Okay, so we got everything on. Now what we're going to do is we're going to turn it on. Now you're still going to have that three red, red rings of death. Now what you're going to do is let it sit for 20 minutes and let it overheat. Now what this does is it re-solders the joints back in here. So we're going to do that until there's only two red lights, so we'll come back in about 20 minutes. Okay, here's the moment of truth. Voila! So we'll let this sit here and run. Looks good. So we'll reassemble and let her run and see. Okay, so the triple check. We'll turn on this Xbox again. See, this is the same Xbox. I didn't edit anything into it. Now let's check see if it works. There we go. You see it as it is. No red rings. Uh, if you're interested in me uh, fixing your Xbox, uh, I'll put my address in the link and send a check payable to me. Uh, like I said, it's twenty dollars for the kit. Uh, it'll be twenty dollars for me to do it, then like fifteen dollars for back shipping. So you're looking at like fifty bucks. And 50 bucks is like cheaper than a new Xbox. So if you're interested in it, I'll put my information in the sidebar and you can make a check. Ship your Xbox to me. Give me about a, a couple days of turnaround time and we'll get you fixed up. So this is my video of the Xbox Red Ring Repair. And I hope you enjoyed it. We'll see you soon. Remember to comment, rate, subscribe. I have other great videos.